Come grocery shopping with me in a world where UC Davis research doesn't exist. I went to grab some Chardonnay and then remembered without UC Davis research, Chardonnay wouldn't be the most widely planted wine grape in California. I was thinking of making pasta tonight, so I'm picking up some sauce, and then I remembered that UC Davis research gave us the mechanical processing of tomatoes that gives us sauce and juice and paste. I'm just going to grab some almonds, although technically without UC Davis research, farmers wouldn't know how to fend off the pests and diseases. I'll go for walnuts, except 85% of walnut production in California is from UC Davis found varieties, so those are out too. Pistachios might do, but UC Davis came up with a pistachio DNA map, so we'll leave those too. Gluten-free bread is a great alternative, but without research from UC Davis, gluten-free bread may not be an option. I would love to grab a peach on my way out, but UC Davis is a major contributor to the development of peach varieties for the public, so I'll leave it. UC Davis made selective breeding of bees possible, and without that, all the produce you're seeing and plants in the store are impacted. I guess it's good that I have no groceries to carry, because without UC Davis research controlling lead as an additive in gasoline, I can't drive home.